The No Way Home trailer has finally surfaced, and it widely confirmed many fans' wildest speculations regarding the multiverse. We are able to see and hear evidence of Willem Dafoe reprising his role as the Green Goblin, Jamie Foxx's Electro, and get a full shot of Alfred Molina's Doc Ock in all of his glory. But while we haven't seen Tobey Maguire or Andrew Garfield in the trailer yet, is it possible that Marvel has intentionally doctored the trailer in order to deliberately omit one or both of the Spider-Men? Stick with us, watchers of the Marvel Multiverse, because we have evidence to suggest that Tobey Maguire and possibly Andrew Garfield not only appear in the film, but appear in the trailer, only to have been deliberately edited out of one scene in particular. First, we need to remember that Marvel has an extensive history of doctoring trailers to their own advantage. To name some of many, they doctored the fact that Captain America's indestructible shield of vibranium gets shattered by Thanos in Endgame, as well as how many of the stones Thanos had collected in Infinity War trailer and actually reduced the number that we saw, and even the fact that Thor loses his eye in Thor Ragnarok in the Ragnarok trailer, just to name some of the more prominent and recent cases. Therefore, it is understandable to believe that Marvel may have deliberately edited out the return of our favorite Spider-Man in this most recent trailer. Well, stick with us, because we don't believe so. Each of these aforementioned shots have been deliberately altered in order to mislead the audience and we believe that Marvel has done it again with No Way Home. So which shot do we believe has been edited for the trailer? We believe the shot on the highway when the pumpkin bomb rolls into frame and Alfred Molina's Doc Ock makes his debut is the one that has been altered, and the evidence is present in two simple words. When Doc Ock emerges, he gives Tom Holland a smile and utters the simple words, Hello, Peter. But according to this theory, he's not actually talking to Tom Holland's iteration of the character in this instance. He greets Peter with a certain sense of familiarity, as if the two of them have interacted before, even going so far as to be on a first-name basis. But this version of Doc Ock and this version of Spider-Man do not have a history nearly this extensive built with one another as of now. They are complete strangers to each other. What if Doc Ock is not in fact greeting Tom Holland Spider-Man, but is instead talking to Tobey Maguire after having been apart for almost 20 years? If this is the case, then it explains why both Raimi villains make their appearance in the same scene, with Green Goblin's pumpkin bomb seemingly rolling along the same highway. If both of the villains from the Raimi trilogy are here, then who is to say that the titular protagonist of the original Spider-Man films is not? What if theoretically, the Green Goblin and Doc Ock are here for Tobey Maguire's Spider-Man and not Tom Holland's. This leads to one of two possible scenarios. Possibility number one is that Toby is already in this scene, and he and Tom Holland have gotten acquainted with one another. If this is the case, then this scene acts as a sort of an ambush on the two Spider-Men, as they will need to face down Doc Ock and the Green Goblin together. This means that Doc Ock emerging onto the highway and uttering the famous, Hello Peter, is unedited, and the shots before it are the ones that are misleading. But that is option number one. The second possibility is that this line actually comes far after Doc Ock emerges, and this second potential option runs on the idea that in between the wide shot and the cut to the up close shot, there is a substantial passage of time in which Tom Holland confronts Doc Ock and potentially the Green Goblin on his own. This theory proposes that they have a fight in which Doc Ock is able to recognize that this is an iteration of Spider-Man, but not the one with whom he is familiar with. In this scene, we propose that either he, or he in the tandem with the Green Goblin, battles Tom Holland into submission, having seemingly beaten him. Holland would fight this battle alone for the first significant duration. Only then does Tobey Maguire make his grand reappearance, swinging into action in order to save Tom Holland. Only then, after this encounter, does Doc Ock finally say, Hello, Peter. In direct reference to Tobey Maguire's iconic iteration of the character, having made his reappearance for the first time since 2007. Either way, this scene is most likely an interaction between Doc Ock and Tobey Maguire, as Alfred Molina has no personal connection to Tom Holland, and this shot was used as a grand reveal shot of Alfred Molina returning to the role. But anyway, my friends, what do you think of this mini theory? Do you believe that Tobey Maguire is actually in this shot, but the footage was altered by Marvel Studios? Do you think that it's actually Tobey Maguire on the highway that encounters both Alfred Molina's Doc Ock, as well as Willem Dafoe's Green Goblin, and he swings in in the last moment to save Tom Holland's iteration of the Web Slinger, after he attempts to fight both of them on his own. Also, what other prominent theories from the trailer and from No Way Home News would you like to hear discussed on the channel? As always, my friends, hit that subscribe button to assemble and join our team, and I hope you guys have a great day.